Luna Rossa dismasting uh, breakdown uh, yesterday. Luna Rossa has uh, dismasted uh, in a oh, quite, uh, let's say, rough way, no? So, exactly. uh, on uh, like probably 20 knots of wind. Yes, maybe uh, they, they report slightly less, uh, 15, yeah. uh, 17, something like this. Uh, not uh, too rough uh, water. No, but, uh, uh, but still, uh, still, uh, still like, tough I mean, conditions. Tough conditions for this kind of boats, sure. For sure. Uh, so we don't know what happened. Uh, what is, was the, I mean, the, the key which makes the made the the mast uh, this mast. Exactly, uh, but, uh, but but we can yeah. fr from the photos we saw today we can figure out quite easily. Exactly. It's uh, it's uh, for sure a piece. Uh, that is uh, on the forest day, on the bottom part of the forest day. So we don't know if it's uh, part of the supplied equipment, which is, uh, talks about the forest day. So exactly. we don't know exactly uh, where it arrives, the, the supplied part, uh, or if uh, it was a part uh, made by the, the yacht itself, exactly. by Luna Rossa itself, uh, uh, to connect the forest to the, to the boat. So, which is probably the case actually. Or the boat itself also. Or the boat itself, this uh, could have happened. For sure, uh, we know that this part uh, can uh, be disconnected yes. if needed. So for sure, everybody has developed uh, some kind of uh, locking system. And uh, obviously, the, a failure of uh, the locking system is uh, the easiest uh, thought you, you can have. No? Exactly. Obviously. Everything is lying on, uh, on this part. Uh, so, so there was no no B plan. No, there is no other no, no other cable connecting uh, the mast uh, to the to the bow. Uh, the sail actually is probably uh, we thought about it, but probably is hoisted uh, via a zipper system. Exactly. So, uh, which is one of the system that is allowed. So, uh, if you sail uh, Majest 20 or uh, this kind of boats, uh, uh, normally what you what you do is uh, you have a long zipper all along the laft. So you start. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, you use the, the halyard uh, to hoist the sail, obviously. And then, uh, in the case of the Majest 20, there is also the Furley system. But uh, in this case, you just use the, the zipper. You close the zipper once the sail goes up uh, and then uh, you yeah. you just have to to connect uh, the tack uh, the tack uh, to uh, some kind of uh, pulling system down no exactly to adjust uh, the the the, the love tuning because on the top for sure there is a, a, lock, a, lock, system. a lock system for sure yeah. for the higher. Uh, so yes this is obviously the best system to have or at least uh, all the system which uh, have the the laugh, uh, closed Mm -hmm. uh, are, uh, are dynamically better, exactly. of course. So uh, probably you could use anks, but uh, honestly, yeah. this doesn't change that much. But still, uh, okay. looks like it's uh, it's a zipper system. It's exactly. Yeah. Uh, so mm, it's easy that uh, also this part connecting uh, the the tack of the of the um, sail uh, is whether it's connected to the stay uh, itself. So it it came out with the stay uh, itself. itself. Uh, or just broke uh, exactly broke some part either the attachment to the to the deck or or the a part of the of the tack of the sail I mean exactly uh, for sure it could uh, be connected to the boat and not to the estate uh, it's not uh, necessary but could uh, could be like this but still obviously I mean uh, with this kind of load uh, sudden load uh, uh, and also is not a part that uh, could uh, bears this kind of loads. Of course. I mean, uh, in my personal boat, I remember that I, I broke uh, in a similar way the forest day. In this case, it was the top, uh, but uh, the sail uh, stayed uh, stayed there. So, exactly. So kept the, the mast upright in this particular case. In case of Luna Rossa, this sudden load uh, obviously is exactly. much more than, uh, exactly. than, than the tack of a sail can, can bear. So. Exactly. Obviously, it's not, no, no surprise it has come away. So, for sure, it's the bottom, I would say, quite sure it's the, it's the bottom, bottom because you see two cables uh, coming down uh, through the uh, jib, no? Exactly, uh, through the jib. So, one is, uh, uh, one is the, the stay and the other is the halyard. The halyard, uh, exactly. With uh, its lock system, uh, which probably uh, came, uh, came down uh, because uh, this lock system normally. Uh, unlocks themselves when they are <laughs> not under load. So exactly. uh, when the, for sure, when the mast uh, um, uh, was unloaded, the, the, the lock system just uh, 
uh, came, down. When came down. Then also, also obviously the, the jeep was short uh, uh, along the stay because uh, because it was a uh, yeah. strong wind sail. Strong wind sail. So, so it was uh, like a square top, uh, but uh, shorter, shorter at the top. So what, what we we said also yesterday, before seeing that the dynamics has been cons- confirmed, so so the boat was under uh, power, let's say, so it was uh, sailing like a straight line, so it uh, it was having uh, very very likely the upwind uh, arm uh, hoisted exactly uh, outside of the water, and the other one uh, foiling uh, in a normal way. So what what happens in this case is when when you break something. Which was the case. Mm-hmm. <laughs> then the, the mast uh, goes uh, backwards, and then uh, obviously uh, to leeward. To leeward. Okay. Exactly. But uh, the boat uh, um, heels uh, to windward suddenly because obviously the the, the arm uh, is weighing all, Wait, uh, on, exactly, this, uh, so all on this side. So what happens is that uh, this uh, combined movement makes uh, a leverage. You must imagine the, the mast. Uh, leveraging on the on the side of, uh, of the yacht exactly okay and then uh, breaks uh, something which is uh, in this case the bottom of the mast the bottom the mast of the mast okay. so which which is uh, what appears to be broken uh, in the bottom of the, part of the mast exactly uh, this is obviously uh, a crucial part of the mast mm-hmm. uh, but actually uh, if you think about it uh, it's uh, it's better if this part of the mast is breaking because uh, it doesn't affect uh, much the, the tube, uh, the the tube, tube uh, and uh, when you <laughs> when they will repair it, uh, they will add some weight, but uh, in the in the bottom part of the uh, exactly. of the mast. So uh, it's better than uh, just uh, uh, repairing something uh, up on the mast. Exactly. Mm-hmm. We don't know if it's the only part uh, broken. No, for sure, course. this kind of leverage uh, should have uh, damaged uh, a little bit the hull, for sure. And uh, maybe the mast in this point, uh, but uh, not uh, in a terrible way. Let's no. uh, this, let's uh, think about this. The mast uh, looks uh, all in one piece, uh, exactly. without uh, any big issue. Probably some one spreader has, uh, has been broken. Has been broken, probably. Exactly. And, uh, and, and uh, of course they have to check uh, well all the all the masts. So the mast. they, uh, they have to. Uh, see inside the, the laminate to see That's if okay. there has been uh, something uh, uh, really damaged in the in this uh, in this occasion because obviously there are points where uh, you may not see any crack but uh, actually the the mast is delaminated. Exactly. So a, lo- a lot of loads. I mean, the, in theory, when the, the mast is falling down in the water, the top part uh, is not that loaded no. because there is not the hull, uh, no longer the hull uh, actually weighing on the mast. So, so this kind of part, uh, if nothing has happened uh, during uh, the, the accident, uh, then when it falls in the water, probably nothing has happened. But uh, as uh, as we told, uh, the the bottom part uh, could have been uh, forced, uh, has exactly. been forced, has been forced. Yes, so, oh, so this has to be checked. Uh, so then also a- another uh, another issue is that uh, the the bottom of the sail is uh, fixed to the, exactly. to the yacht, to the yacht, to the, yacht, to the boom, uh, to the pantograph boom or what uh, Prada is using. But anyway, is fixed in the cent- on the center line of the yacht, and so when uh, the the mast has gone down then this part uh, has not uh, just uh, gone away exactly uh, we, uh, which could happen in uh, other yachts uh, even if there is still uh, at least uh, the the, the main the main sheet, the main sheet uh, at the bottom of the of the boom but but some something is still uh, is still holding but uh, in this case uh, in this case there has been a breakage obviously on the sail uh, that uh, have been pulled uh, exactly, pulled, uh, exactly. Uh, on all this, obviously, the, the problem for Luna Rossa is uh, now they have uh, only, let's say, two uh, good masts uh, left. Okay. So they can, uh, all the boats can uh, just uh, build three masts. Uh, and now one of them uh, for Luna Rossa is for sure a uh, training mast, will not be yes. uh, useful for uh, the, the events of the World Series, nor for uh, obviously the Prada Cup and uh, the America's Cup. 
uh, eventually. Or, uh, or at least, I mean, I would not be that, uh, I mean, uh, it's, it's not terrible. No, it's The not breakage terrible. is not terrible, but, uh, but still uh, you, you would prefer to use another. For exactly. Sure. For because sure. some kind of delamination, uh, something that uh, likely has happened. Uh, actually, also in terms of uh, sales, uh, they cannot build much many sales and mm -hmm. they cannot uh, uh, replace uh, more than 25% of each uh, of each sale uh, without considering it a, a new sale so actually uh, mm -hmm. this is an more, event more like this main sale for sure is a training main sale yeah for <laughs> this, is, uh, this is for this sure is a guarantee and uh, that, yes. obviously the problem is uh, the two no, the two main sales so two so main sales so <laughs> two skills uh, now you you have uh, a lot less space to to try things no, on no so That's you okay. cannot uh, you cannot try a, a lighter mast probably <laughs> and uh, all the modification you uh, you probably want to do on the mainsails and on the jibs uh, uh, to to try different designs and everything uh, now you you lose some uh, uh, some percentage of uh, of replacing just uh, uh, with this uh, with this event so this event, uh, no, tough, not the uh, lucky one exactly. not the lucky one tough days for Luna Rossa we honestly if it was me I would not have uh, uh, taken already taken the second and the third mast because the masts were rumored to have uh, some kind of problems no exactly the so uh, some kind of uh, delamination issues and some point so the first mast so probably the guys uh, had uh, waited a little bit for the second and the third, uh, the third master to be sure to have uh, very good stuff uh, uh, for the important events. Exactly. So maybe Luna Rosa may lose a few days because of this. Exactly. They, they, they will work hard. They will work hard. They don't need to do it perfect, uh, probably. But, but still, uh, but still uh, they, they have some, some days uh, days of work uh, and I guess they will put up uh, the same mast. Exactly. Uh, the problem is obviously they don't have uh, any mule, exactly. any surrogate yacht, so uh, they, they will need to stay in shore, no? they will need to stay Exactly. Uh, they probably online. have, uh, maybe they still have uh, their first uh, surrogate yacht, the small, very small one, very small one. but it's not, uh, not that useful and then uh, it's rumored uh, to be uh, broken, broken. <laughs> so so we don't know actually so but still is not that useful exactly so, so uh, they will uh, go in front of the pc of the mm -hmm. simulator and uh, just uh, uh, stay in fun, front uh, of the simulator in front of the gym for the <laughs> grinders and, uh, exactly. and but so still uh, still i mean uh, for uh, a short team like luna rossa this can be also work uh, very very uh, fast uh, to, yes. to be done to put back uh, this mast uh, uh, to be to be able to be used not perfect but to be able to be used for a few days uh, this could be relatively easy so i would not be surprised if uh, in one week time we will see again lunar rocks on the water honestly yes. even, even totally maybe good. slightly less mm -hmm. we will see we will see if, we'll uh, see. Uh, if they will push this uh, this so much to to go out on the water. Exactly. Thank you. Ciao. Ciao ciao.